Let's take a look at the support application. This is a web-based application best suited for Mozilla Firefox or Google Chrome and cannot be found in a mobile application store. It's accessible through our website at keystoneschoolonline.com. And to get to it, all you have to do is go to that website. And in the right hand corner, you'll see a red login button that says Keystone Login. Go ahead and click that. On the right hand side, you'll have some information about what is the Keystone Support application. And it is a one-stop access to your student's account profile, assessment pacer, billing information, the Keystone teacher link, and much more. So you can read about some features and click on the support application button at the bottom to log in. From here, your username is going to be the email that we have on file for you as the support person here with Keystone. If you ever do need to change your email address on the account, please contact our student support representatives. And if it does change, then the username to your support application will change as well. The first time that you get into the support application, you will have to set up a password by clicking on the password reset button underneath the blue login button. Input your username email, and you'll get an email within about 15 minutes to set up that password. But once you have that information, you can log in. The first thing that you will see on your screen is a scrolling set of announcements that we put up here to get out to our students and families, information about Keystone Clubs, notifications, different events, and a lot of other things. The ones that you see on your screen may or may not be current, so do check out your support application for updated announcements. Underneath the announcements, you do have some options you can click on. The support application is able to be utilized with an Amazon Alexa device. So if you'd like to figure out exactly how to do that, you can have information, an Alexa user guide emailed to you by clicking on this button. The next one underneath is for student courses. This is where you can see the classes that your student is taking. If you have more than one student with Keystone, as long as you have the same support email listed for each student, you'll be able to access all of the students in one account. So here we have a set of our demo accounts listed as quote unquote students. So we're going to go ahead and click on our high school one. And this will show you a quick snapshot of what classes the student is taking, uh, the due date, the status, the date that they were enrolled, the grade that they currently have in the class, the percentage of course completion, um, the last time an assessment was graded, and the total assessment count for a class. You can also utilize the assessment pacer from here by clicking on the title of a course. If you would like directions on how to use the assessment pacer, check out our assessment pacer video in the Keystone Getting Started Quick Guide. Underneath student courses, you're able to pull a progress report. You can pull these at any time that you'd like. Choose the student that you want to pull it for, and this will give you a printable PDF of your student's progress. This is typically updated every single day, and you can check back as often as you need. Underneath the progress report, you can access the student academic record, which is an unofficial copy of your student's transcript or grade report. If you'd like to request an official copy of a transcript or grade report and have it sent to another institution, such as um, a transferring school or a college or university, you can check out our parchment service by clicking on this link here. Next, you have student profile information, your profile information. You can change some information, um, such as an email address or a phone number to keep things updated. You're able to pay your bill, sign up for a time to speak with a student success advisor or guidance counselor. You can also email our student support representatives by clicking on support request. It'll bring up a form you can fill out with a subject and a message. Click send and that will get sent off to our support team um, in case you have any account questions. If you ever have questions with your student that you need to contact a teacher for, you have links to the Keystone teacher link here. For high school and middle school, electives, English, math, science, and social studies. By clicking on these, it'll open your native email client and you'll be able to send an email directly from that client. Underneath the Keystone teacher link, you can find the school profile, um, our school handbook, and some terms of service for the website here. If you have any further questions, please feel free to reach out to us, student success advisors at studentsuccess at keystonehighschool.com.